Hello everybody, Joe Gothier here with another lighthearted devotional. Today's devotional is about pastors. Now I know what you're thinking, pastors, huh? Are we going to be learning how to give a sermon or turn water into grape juice? Well, not quite, but we're certainly going to appreciate the pastors a bit more. Now the role of the pastor in the fivefold ministry, they are like the world's best coaches, but for your soul. They're in charge of fostering spiritual growth, guiding the flock, and always keeping an eye out there for what might be straying from the path. Kind of like a spiritual GPS, recalculating, make a U-turn from temptation in 500 feet. <laughs> being a pastor is a bit like being a gardener. It's all about planting the right seeds watering them, giving them enough light, and keeping the pests away. And of course, having the patience to wait for the seeds to sprout. Pastors don't just wake up one day with a full-grown congregation of spiritually mature Christians. It takes time, patience, and probably a fair share of miracle growth, or at least the spiritual equivalent. <laughs> now this job isn't all sunshine and roses. Pastors all need also need to be there for their flock in hard times, providing comfort, comfort and guidance. They're kind of like the spiritual weathermen, helping us weather the storms of life. Today's forecast, 100% chance of God's love, with scattered trials throughout the afternoon. But don't worry, you've got an umbrella of faith to keep us dry. 1 Peter 5, verses 2 and 4 Give pastors their marching orders. Shepherd the flock of God, which is among you, serving as overseers, not by compulsion, but willingly, not for dishonest gain, but eagerly, not as being lords over those entrusted to you, but being example to the flock. And when, Christ, when chief shepherd appears, you will receive the crown of glory that does not fade away. In other words, don't be a pastor because you think it's a cushy job or because you want to lord it over others. Be a pastor because you're passionate about you're passionate about shepherding God's people and setting a good example. Because let's face it, shepherding people is a lot harder than shepherding sheep. At least sheep only stray when they see greener grass. The pastor's role is unique and filled with a lot of pressure but it's also a position of great joy. As a pastor, you get the privilege of leading others in their spiritual journey, witnessing their night, I'm sorry, witnessing their highs and lows and being there to provide guidance and support. So here's to our pastors. Thank you for keeping us on the straight and narrow and for always having the best advice. Keep up the good work and remember to take care of yourself too. After all, even spiritual GPSs need a recharge. Hey guys, if you like my videos, please consider giving me a like. Maybe subscribe to the channel with a bell notification on. And share these videos with anyone that you think might enjoy them. I hope you have a great and blessed day. God bless you all.